we're at Sharon Speedway, uh, World of Outlaws. Uh, they just ran the Four Crown race last night. Actually, Four Crown's going on in Eldora tonight. Um, I don't get over here to race at Sharon too often, so we wanted to come over and make an attempt at it anyway, and it worked out that it was with the World of Outlaws, and, and uh, we get to race with the best. So, race is over. Uh, if the car was good, I get out and I talk to my wife about you know, what was good about it, and if it was bad, I throw my steering wheel, even though I don't really get mad, but I set the steering wheel out, you know, we get out, we talk about what happened, and then it's pretty much get ready for the kids to come down. So I built these two, they're eight foot PVC, uh, basically two by fours. I got a couple edges that I built on them so that the cars stay on. Uh, just built a little stand and did a lot of testing with this to make sure that we had the right distance, the right speed, so that the cars would make it to the end and all that. So the kids will come up, if they got a flag or something, I always sign their flag, uh, and then they'll pick a car out of their, their uh, the rack up there, I got a bunch of them. They'll pick a car and then I'll pick a car. And I try and set the track up to where one side's faster so that the kids win. And then after all the kids are gone, some adults want to come and race, and then I don't let them know which the fastest lane is, I try and beat them. But uh, so they'll pick a car, I'll pick a car. If I win, they get to keep their car. And if they win, they get them both. All I ever wanted to be was a race car driver. I, I just thought race car driving was a thing for me. I had heroes when I was a little kid. I just thought it was so cool to have the opportunity to go up and see those racers when I was little. And they would, you know, if they gave me time, you know, that just, that made my day. These guys are race car drivers, they're my heroes, you know? Um, so I just wanted to, be in a position where I could do that for kids. One of the first piece, uh, people that sent me cars was Brian Dunlap. He saw it um, and he sent me a, I don't know, 50 pack or something on Amazon. And because uh, he really liked what we were doing, uh, JJ Yaley sent me a, a real nice box of stuff from the old Eldora Million cars and stuff we gave away as special cars. Uh, Janet Holbrook has helped me out several times with money. J&J has, has come on. Tulsa Driveways is a, is gonna be a lot bigger on the race car next year. He's helped me out a lot. I've never been out of cars. I spent $100 on the first cars that we did, and then from there, honestly, people will come up and handshake me money. Bill and Penny Shaker is on the side of my car. That's just people that come up and handshake me money. Even more than, you know, just doing something for the kids, I build a lot of relationships through this. Obviously, I've got Grace Community Church on the car. I have a, a motive with that, you know, obviously, so we're trying to, trying to get people to see Jesus in that way, so you just, this whole world is about relationships, so we're, we're trying to do that through this.